Hi everyone, welcome to our channel. So today we're going to discuss about duality law. So in the previous class we discussed about uh, logical equivalence using truth tables. So now we'll discuss about duality law. So what is duality law? For example, if we have two formulas A and A star. So uh, these two formulas A and A star so if two formulas A and A star are said to be dual to each other, if and only if one can be obtained from uh, one can be obtained from changing this sign. Uh, for example, this is and right and to or or else or to and then they are said to be dual. That means, for example, if I have P and Q and changing it to P or Q, so this one is dual to this one. Okay? So, uh, simply changing the symbol here from and to or. For example, if I have like this, P or Q. Okay? So, it is changed to or is changed to and. So, P and Q is dual to P or Q. Okay, so what is dual here? Uh, two formulas A and A star are said to be dual to each other. If and only if one can be obtained from, uh, from one can be obtained from by changing and to or 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 to and. Okay, so and is called as conjunction and or is called as disjunction. So this and is called conjunction. Or is called disjunction so this is and this is or so and is called conjunction or is called disjunction ok so what is duality law here two formulas a and a star are said to be dual if and only if one can be obtained from by changing the symbol from uh, and to or or from or to and so we will see identity laws uh, which follow duality law so we'll see identity principles which follow duality law and later on and after this topic we'll solve this duality principle okay for example if i say identity law so how it is solved so we'll see example for that so but now uh, we'll see uh, identity rules for uh, this uh, which follow duality law okay now we'll see logical identities okay so we call it as logical identities which follow duality principle and remember these logical identities are most most important you should remember this okay uh, why because uh, in future videos we will solve some problems like uh, uh, dnf uh, cnf that means we will uh, discuss about normal forms disjunct to normal form conjunct to normal form there we should use all these identities to uh, reduce our problem to solve our problem okay so please remember these all identities or else in examination they will ask you like this uh, prove that uh, this de Morgan's law is logically equivalent or not ok so now we will see whether these logical identities are dual or not so first coming to de Morgan's law so what is de Morgan's law negation of P or Q negation of P or Q is equivalent to negation P and negation Q so this is de Morgan's law so here the negation is common right so negation p now negation of or becomes and okay so negation p and negation q so what is duality principle which i said or will be changed to and if we have and and will be changed to or so here we have or it will be changed to and here we have and it will be changed to or so exactly like mirror image okay or will be changed to and Okay, so uh, if we have uh, and here, so if we place a mirror, what we get? We get or. So this is duality, right? So negation of P or Q equal to negation P and negation Q, which is uh, uh, 2 is negation of P and Q. So change or to and and to or. So here we can say that 2 is dual to 1. So this one is dual, dual of first one. So this is de Morgan's law. Okay, so uh, remember these laws, most most important. So next is associative laws. So what is associative law? P or Q or R 
equal to P or Q or R. So P or Q or R in brackets equal to logically equivalent to P or Q or R. So what is it? Convert R to and. So P and Q and R equal to P and Q and R. So straight away second one is dual of first one. So this is associative law. And third one commutative law. Commutative law is P or Q equal to Q or P. So A or B equal to B or A. Okay, vice versa. So P or Q equal to Q or P. So what about duality? R will be changed to and. So P and Q equal to Q and P. So Q is dual to 1. Now first one. Next item potent class. So what is item potent law? P or P equal to P. Okay. P or P equal to P. So that is true or true equal to true like that. So P or P equal to P. So uh, R will be changed to and in dual. So P and P equal to P. So 2 is dual to 1. So only uh, principle which we can't apply duality is double negation. Okay, for double negation we can't apply duality. Why? Because we don't have any OR operator or AND operator. So what is double negation here? Negation of negation is nothing but negation of negation P. Negation negation gets cancelled, we'll get P. Or neg negation of negation Q equal to Q. So this is double negation. So next is distributive law. So distributive law is P or Q and R. So P or Q and R equal to P or Q and P or R. So we are distributing it. P or Q and P or R. So uh, duality is change R in the place of 1 and and in the place of R. So P and Q or R equal to P and Q or P or R. So we can say that 2 is dual to 1. And the last one is absorption law. So what is absorption law here? P or P and Q equal to P. Okay. So P or P and Q equal to P. So exactly change from R to under. So P and P or Q equal to P. So these are the logical identities for checking whether uh, they are dual to each other or not. So now uh, in, the, in my next video, we will solve uh, 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 D Morgan's or associative law and whether we, uh, we need to check uh, these two. For example, uh, first we will solve for this. For example, ne negation of P or Q equal to negation P and negation Q and we will solve this one. And we'll see. Uh, we'll check both truth tables. Okay. So uh, this this is all about uh, logical identities and uh, dual law. Dual law we call it as dual principle and logical identities whether it is following dual laws or not. So um, the students who are watching my channel for the first time, I request you to please subscribe my channel and please share my videos to your friends WhatsApp groups who are studying in different other colleges so that it will be helpful for them. And please uh, subscribe my channel and please tell your friends to subscribe my channel and please share all my videos to your friends and please uh, support my channel in all possible ways. Thank you. Thank you very much and have a wonderful day.